what we have here is a Ruger 1022 receiver inside of a very neat chassis made by Crazy Ivan, which is located in the United States. This is their original chassis stock system, which is specifically designed for a 1022 to fit into. Their chassis come with everything needed to get it installed, and it's quite easy to do, and you can add many other components to it, which makes it, in our opinion, the ideal chassis to go with if you want to create something that turns heads and simply have fun at the range. So the original chassis we have in front of us weighs only 13.79 ounces. They also make an original light version, which is just 12.98 ounces. The upper and lower chassis is CNC machined from a single billet of military grade 6061 T6 hardened aluminum alloy and then finished with a mil spec anodized hard coat, which feels really nice in the hand. No complaints here. Also to note, the firearm will still disassemble and assemble with the single Ruger 1022 factory takedown screw. The top of the Crazy Ivan features a Picatinny rail so you can mount whatever red dot or scope or just whatever you prefer. Any standard air compatible free float handguard can be used on the chassis and allows for a buffer tube and any type of buttstock which now gives you many more options for customizations and as you can see here there is a Magpul MOE stock installed to it. So you might be wondering, why is there a Remington magazine attached to this rifle? Well, this right here is a Spectre Ballistics 1022 magazine adapter, which allows you to run Remington magazines. Also to note, you are not confined to only 10 rounds. And we must say, it looks really nice with the curved longer mags, and we think it just adds and complements the chassis so well. So moving on, as you can tell, there is a BX trigger installed in this rifle and it is an absolute must upgrade and definitely worth the money. So moving on down, you'll notice there is a unique skeletonized grip. This also comes from the Crazy Ivan website. Again, they carry a ton of accessories and the skeletonized grip gives it a really sleek look and feel. So moving on to the front of the rifle, you'll notice that there is a 12 inch carbon fiber barrel installed. Definitely a great addition and allows you to thread on any muzzle device if you so please. The free float handguard is from True North Arms here in Canada. They carry a ton of accessories that are very well made and affordable. So all in all, this is a super short package that is within regulation. Here in Canada, so long as the overall length is a minimum of 26 inches, you are good to go. This here is about 27 inches. And to round off this video, let's see some action shots out of the Crazy Ivan. And as always, if you're not already subscribed to the channel, make sure you subscribe, hit that alert button, you'll be notified when we release new and exciting content. Until next time.